On busy days, parking in downtown Slo can be a very long and stressful process to find that perfect spot. However, at a recent Slo City Council meeting, the city is aiming to improve parking in the downtown area. The city is reworking their parking and access management plan, which hasn't been updated in over a decade. The city is ready to roll out plans making parking efficient, improve safety for bikers and pedestrians, and introduce a new parking center. It's a time for us to re-envision what our downtown community looks like um, and how people interface with parking and mobility in downtown. Currently, crews are working downtown on improved sidewalks and new bike lanes to safely slow down traffic in the area. The new bike lanes and pedestrian areas will allow for downtown to be much more accessible. You know, our intent is to open up those sidewalks, make them more user-friendly, and provide a better experience, a more walkable downtown. So that's our goal um, with a lot of the initiatives we're doing right now. The city will also be pushing for curbside parking to work more closely with parking apps in place of meters for convenience. The city has slowly been using apps in place of meters to create a more efficient system. The city council has also been beta testing usage of the apps in parking garages to make better use of the spaces in garages and focus on reducing carbon emissions from constant circling. Our real goal is to get people that are operating vehicles off the main streets and into the parking structures. We don't want people driving around looking for a parking stall when we have adequate parking in our parking structures. The most notable update will be the construction of a new parking structure titled the Cultural Arts District Parking Center. The parking center will replace the current Palm Napomo parking lot located in the southwest area of downtown. It's going to be the home of a 403 parking stall uh, garage. It's going to have uh, EV charging in there and solar arrays to help uh, offset that need. We're hoping to have EV bike charging in there additionally. That's going to be a great addition to help improve parking in our southwest corner of the downtown area um, and meet the needs of those businesses and facilities in that area. The center will begin construction in the spring of 2023 and plans have the parking structure being completed in late 2025, early 2026. We want to make sure um, during this time of transition that we're meeting our customers' needs. We always welcome feedback whenever uh, customers uh, have something to say. That's why we're going through the access and parking management plan right now to get that the local feedback and from our community and understand what their needs are. Reporting for Mustang News, I'm Ben Anderson.